Uh, so you got uh, the new album right off the top. Let's talk about that. At least uh, the new single coming out anyway, uh, Let's Go Higher. So uh, to maybe tell us about that, how that came about, and uh, what inspired you to do it. Yeah, well, Let's Go Higher. Like, I recorded it about a year ago with uh, Kobe O'Donis, uh, the great uh, songwriter. And um, that was just something I was doing, you know, off time when when we were touring. You know, when we weren't touring, I was, I was making music. And I always wanted to put a solo album out, and um, now's the time. And... Let's go higher. Is, uh, I think it's the perfect first single because it's it goes right along with everything that's you know kind of out there. It's just a, a big up tempo, uh, feel good dance record, and it, it's going to lend itself great to to the new tour that I'm going on. Yeah, it sounds good. I think we're going to play it a little bit uh, later on today here. Um, in other Jordan Knight news, I mean you're on tour with uh, New Kids on the Block again, teaming up with the Backstreet Boys. So uh, how did that come about? Did that come off the heels of the whole New Year's Eve thing, and you decided this would be a cool idea, or was this planned a long well, time it, ago? It was, it was planned before that. The New Year's Eve thing was kind of uh, to give people a glimpse into what they they would expect on the tour. But uh, we were we did a sh- the New Kids did a show at Radio City Music Hall in New York City, and uh, and the Backstreet Boys were in town, and uh, we invited them to. To the show, but we didn't tell the audience that they were invited. Uh, so we kind of wanted to surprise the audience. Um, we started singing one of their songs um, in an acoustic set, and um, on I Want It That Way. And at a certain point, we stopped, and then the curtain went up, and, and there was the Backstreet Boys for the crowd to see. And uh, the crowd just kind of went crazy. Um, and uh, and uh, from there on out, we, we've always said, you know, let's do a tour together. So we started planning it. Cool. Um, have you found that uh, with uh, the shows that you've done, I mean, like the last couple of years you've been touring with New Kids on the Block as well, and now you're getting set to do uh, this whole tour here. Who do you find who's coming to the shows? Do you find it's, uh, you know, your old fans from back in, uh, you know, the late 80s, early 90s? Do you find it's new fans that you've recruited? Is it a mixed bag of everything, or what do you think? It's definitely a mixed bag, um, but... Um, the core, the core uh, audience there is is fans that have been with us since they were like say five or ten years old. I mean, uh, some girl uh, on the Marilyn Dennis show just today said she was she, she's uh, been a fan since she was ten. Um, so, um, the, you know, it, it's pretty amazing to you know a lot of girls come up and and they show me pictures of like like maybe they they were at a meet and greet you know twenty years ago, and and. They show a picture of, of me and, and her like 20 years ago, and it's so cool to see that, you know, and here we are 20 years later kind of doing the same thing. So it's a beautiful thing. Absolutely, yeah, it's exciting to see. Um, so going back a little while, probably, you know, to the to the time that uh, New Kids split up the first time, I know uh, Jonathan had had his issues on stage when it came to panic attacks and that sort of thing, and that had kind of prevented some reunions going forward. So w- what's different with this time around? I mean, how's he doing? Uh, he's doing great. I mean, you know, he, even I had a, a lot of stage fright in the past, and, um, you know, that's what it is, really. It's it's He doesn't really get panic attacks out of the blue so to speak, but uh, you know, he's 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 a lot more shy than I am, and I and I'm somewhat shy. But uh, yeah, he's doing good. I mean, he he's kind of in the background a little bit, anyhow, in the group, and he's fine being in the background. And so, uh, you know, we just we we band together and we we go ahead and, and push forward. Sounds good. TV stuff. I mean, you've done a fair bit of reality TV over the last uh, few years anyway. Are you going to get into any, uh, I mean, like you did stuff like American Juniors, Surreal Life, and a couple of other shows there, too. I mean, have you thought of uh, getting onto the acting train kind of the way Donnie had? Um, uh, I've thought about it every once in a while. Um, I like to sing and dance better. I, I wouldn't mind maybe trying to act I don't consider myself an actor, though, like Donnie. But uh, I was on his set um, a couple days ago, and uh, it was a lot of fun. And I was just watching uh, how they all put it together and everything else. Um, but uh, it's pretty, it's pretty amazing. We'll see. Cool. Uh, well, we wanted to. Um send a few Facebook questions that we had gotten. You know, some uh, listeners wanted to ask you a few stuff, so I'm just kind of passing along a few questions here. Uh, somebody wanted to know, uh, how often are you proposed to at a show? <laughs> how, often? how many wedding proposals do you get on average during a night? I don't know if I get wedding proposals. <laughs> I get other types of proposals. <laughs> <laughs> um, let's see. Uh, are you doing a solo tour after the whole uh, New Kids on the Block Backstreet Boys thing is done? 
I would. Per- I, I can't say for sure, but I, I wouldn't. I wouldn't say no against spinning off into my own tour. Uh, favorite meal on the road? Is there one thing that you uh, like to eat before a show, or is there something that uh, that you eat on the uh, the tour bus or the plane, or what is it? My favorite meal period is uh, pizza. So does that uh, is that the same on the road as well? Yeah, I would say so. Where's the best pizza? Where's the best pizza? Um, um, I like uh, I like Papa Gino's actually. Do you know what Papa Gino's is? Uh, I can't say I do. Okay, uh, I guess it's an American thing. Uh, what's the best pizza up here? Um, actually, you know what? Pizza, yeah, I think pizza. That right? one's good. Yeah, you know what? No matter where you go, it's uh, it, it's can't lose in Canada. Oh, good, good, good. That's the thing. I mean, wherever you hit, it's going to be good food. Nice. Um, another question was asked: uh, Is the new Kids on the Block cartoon ever going to come back? No, I doubt that. No. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I guess so. You guys are busy with other stuff. But, um, hey, uh, new kids on the block uh, going on tour again with the Backstreet Boys, possibly a uh, Jordan Knight tour in the future. But uh, one more time, a new album. What's it called and when's it coming out? My new album comes out in May, and it's called Unfinished. Uh, Single out now called Let's Go Higher. Hey, uh, Jordan Knight, new kids on the block. Uh, Have fun at uh, Canadian Music Week there, and uh, all uh, the best to you with the rest of the tour, okay? Thank you, sir. Thanks,